The reservoir may soon reach dead pool levels as Lake Mead keeps dropping to dangerously low levels. Millions of people in California, Arizona, Nevada, and a portion of Mexico received their drinking water from Lake Mead, the biggest reservoir in the United States that was created by the Hoover Dam on the Colorado River. Since last year, water levels have continued to drop to record lows, and they are now perilously close to becoming a dead pool, which occurs when water cannot flow to a dam and is too low to flow downstream. According to the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation, the Hoover Dam requires a minimum surface elevation of 1,050 feet in order to produce electricity. Anything lower than that is referred to as an inactive pool, and at an altitude of 895 feet, there is a dead pool. According to Bureau of Reclamation data, the water level at Lake Mead was 1,043.82 feet on Thursday morning, which puts it fewer than 150 feet from being a dead pool. Since the mega drought has gotten so bad, several human remains have been discovered in Lake Mead over the past month, some of which may have been thrown there. In an effort to continue producing power and delivering water for necessary needs, a decrease in water flows to Arizona, Nevada, and Mexico was made when Lake Mead experienced its first-ever water shortfall in August of last year. The Bureau of Reclamation predicts that levels at Lake Mead will reach a point in July 2023 where more cutbacks may be necessary. This year, water levels will probably stay low until the start of the wet season in November.